I want to. We're just yeah, up. We shook today's, it up. You're saying you can go to your left. Today's we're just going to keep it going. Is this is an interesting study they did. So obviously, uh, cars that drive themselves would be better drivers than people, right? That's pretty well established. Although you two don't seem to like it. it. I don't so know. You don't yeah, like it. I'm not a fan. Well, let me tell you why. Okay, so what they found out with this study is just inserting 5% of cars that drove themselves in a traffic study, traffic improved. Because those cars, they started to train on them. People started to train on them and realize what they were doing. So a lot of traffic, the biggest problem with traffic, sounds obvious, is intersection, one way or another, whether it be an on-ramp, off-ramp, or an actual intersection. And the problem is that when it turns green, it takes X amount of time for a person to react. Then the person behind them reacts. Then the person behind them is eating a banana that takes longer for them to react. So they can't get through. Whereas a car <laughs> that drove itself, look, there's there a banana. Is. There a is. car that drove itself, they'd all take off at the same time. Right? Oh. So you don't have the same problem. There's a lot of other things like this. The phantom traffic jam on a highway, which is when somebody cuts somebody else off. They break. Another person breaks behind them. The whole thing goes Those down. Those drive me nuts. And a, a car that was a smart car wouldn't do that because it would never cut somebody off. So, so in theory, if everybody drove straight and didn't cut each other off, none of this would ever happen. But we, we're going to explore this more, I think, next week. And I'm going to ask people what they think. Is right. this a resistance to it? <laughs> Deep dive. And I think it's control. Can we all just right. be better drivers? No, yeah, we tried that. We're not good drivers. <laughs> it's just the bottom line. Cindy's here with a look at what's coming.